Hello guys, uh, welcome to another episode of the Cup Talk Show. Now, before we continue, just please remember to subscribe and uh, hit notification, the notification button. Yeah, so that uh, you can always catch up with our good topics here. Now, if you haven't uh, caught up with the previous uh, topics, please go ahead after this, go and check out what we had for you earlier along. Uh, now, today, I'm joined by uh, the two ladies, Shan, and Patricia as always and uh, we're going to be talking about something that uh, is really uh, common with the young people today and that's the parting life yeah parting parting party after party yeah Monday to Friday I think every bar or club in Uganda has a theme night yeah there's always uh, an event somewhere in Lugogo yeah Chadondo or so so uh, and uh, this has always uh, had uh, the young people engaged and caught up in this nightlife or event life. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So the question today is, how do you get to know if you are partying too much? Yeah. That's the question that I'll be uh, posing, not to just these ladies, but you can also tell us in the comment section, when do you get to know as an individual that, hey, you know what? I think I've hit the ceiling when it comes to the partying life as an individual. Mm-hmm. So... I'll start with Patricia. Patricia, when do you think or when do you get to know that you are actually partying way too much? <laughs> Thank you, Marvin. Uh, hi, everyone. So I think when you know that you're partying too much is when you are actually, you go beyond your means just to go out. I think that's one. Like we've seen people who would... Uh, literally even just borrow money just to attend an event we've seen people who would just abandon their responsibilities just to you know <laughs> like though you see like, like, i've been seeing memes going around like we're in timuri day like now <laughs> now the, <laughs> they are now feeling the pressure now yeah. after them spending their rent money just because True. to attend a trending event i feel like that is not right i feel like now you're over partying you should party when you are you can afford it and you're in your means not beyond what you can afford also i think okay. when someone uh, abandons their responsibilities just to go and party that is over partying i feel like people just exaggerate it like i don't know i just feel like it's it's not worth it like you can party any other time party tegwa Every day we see new events coming up. What? There are so many things. It, as time passes by, so many trends are coming up. So really, why would you abandon your responsibilities just to, you know, for the sake, for the sake of going out? Yeah? yeah. We've seen people who uh, even would not go to work because by no kuba party. Okay, they're even more, <laughs> more, 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 I don't know, more sensitive things to do. Yeah. You know, like, for example, maybe you have a family, but you don't even care about your kid, you know. You want to go and party. No matter what you go and you just left them with a neighbor because, yo, I have to go and party. Yeah. <laughs> so I feel like for me, those are like key things that I would say that's when a person is overdoing it, like. They're over. All right. <laughs> yeah. All right. Thank you, uh, mm. Patricia. Mm. Now, uh, just like we said, uh, those are Patricia's opinions. And yeah. if you feel like you can add something on, mm. please don't hesitate to use the comment section. Yeah. We'll be uh, glad to hear from you. So, uh, uh, Shan Fifi. Yeah. So, <laughs> tell us. <laughs> tell us. When do you think a person is now, you know, over the top when it comes to, uh, you know, parting? Like, when do you. Th- like yeah now the cup is overflowing okay thank you so much marvin and um i don't think uh, my 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 tip will differ from patricia's but when uh, someone starts being irresponsible like let's let's talk about someone who's uh let me say married you come back late you have okay. children your, your children barely see you uh 
you, you everyone complains about you at work you're always dozing you're always taking energy drinks like you can't do i <laughs> mean <laughs> 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 and some something else is also still about money like you you you're going to to get money from someone or there are these people who say like they can have money to take them to 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 a party in place for as long as there's someone who's going to buy them what drinks yeah that's, <laughs> that's, that's <laughs> like sometimes when you you're not spending anything you just mm. don't care you just move Why until you, just you go and at some point it it you at least change call your circles when you change call your circles and maybe try to mm. you see that you've been overdoing something mm. but when you stay in the same clique like your friends are always going out doing mm. this True. you will not know that you're doing it too much yeah but when you change call your circles you'll be like let me call let me do this mm. or when you try when you try to to change your mm. you'll be like let me do this instead of going out mm. you see that people who are overdoing it uh, just not I don't know how to say it. They're always there. They don't have uh, progress. Mm. Like you, every money that you're going to get, you're going to think about going out. Yeah. Your fr- people of your age are getting things that mm. they're doing things that are productive, and all you can do is go out, drink. I uh, know. And for these guys who love women, <laughs> you know. you give guys, your money guys to love women. women. Guys love women. <laughs> don't be like these guys in love women. Okay, too much. Oh okay. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so you spend your money men. on a woman, and then you you go back and tell your friends, you know what? I have no money. Like you even have nothing to eat. Mm. But because you're trying to to impress this girl, you go out to them buy expensive things. Mm. Just you you don't even sure if that girl loves you or not. So mm. you try to you, you try to to give yourself like a test to be like, let me try to 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 mm. to go out with this. So when you try to, to to test yourself like that, you know that I've been overdoing this and it mm. is not good. You know the yeah. bad that mm. comes with that. You get. So mm. I think that is it from me. Mm. All right, all right. Uh, that's it uh, from uh, Shan. Yeah. <laughs> Just like you had that. Now mm. again a reminder: the comment section. Yeah, because <laughs> this is something that uh, we are mm. all doing. Yeah, uh, idea. Yeah, at the particular maybe age of our mm. lives. The moment you hit campus, it's like it's like it's uh the thing is uh it's like another pandemic mm. in the universities. Mm. Yeah, like before you know it, the moment is Thursday. Status only what. Only no, why you understand? No. Come to the center. <laughs> Come to the center. You understand? So you just can't trust mm. uh, because there's uh, an event, a party, uh, mm. almost left, right, and uh, and uh, center. So for me, I would think the only some of the uh, the ways, one of the ways you can uh, mm. identify that you have actually, you know, oh, hit that then. the ceiling when it mm. comes to party in life. If you are there and uh, you've oh, you've ever googled, am I over partying? Yeah. If you have a Googled, that means you personally have actually realized the fact that you... <laughs> there are even people who Google. Yeah. yeah there, of course, there are other things that happen to us. And then you, you first consult that uh, person who never charges that much. That consultant who never charges that too much. And that's Google. You understand? So if you have Googled, am I putting too much? Bro. Yeah? <laughs> you're you're, you're overdoing <laughs> now. Now you're overdoing it. Yeah? Now that that, that means that it does actually hit you. Yeah. Now some other thing for me, I, I think it will be the obsession. Like you always are talking about the event, what happened at the event, when is the next event? Mm. You understand? You're Everything. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Like you're always talking about parting, parting, parting. You understand, mm. bro? There are chances that you're overdoing it. Mm-hmm. Another thing is. If you're the plug, <laughs> if you're the plug that uh, these guys are, is come to like, bro. <laughs> Where are we? Yeah. Going to next? What's Stop. the exactly? <laughs> what's the plan tonight? You understand? If you are the kind of person that they they, they go to, yeah. In mm-hmm. case uh, the weekend is knocking, but yeah. Really bro, check yourself. <laughs> you're overdoing it, I think. Yeah. Because because yeah. you see, these people sometimes ask, uh, "Where are we at tonight?" Yeah. These are not the people that usually frequent. Mm. Mm. You understand? Because they don't know the exact places that are catching. Exactly. Uh, yeah. So they don't frequent. Mm. So they only come to you because they know you're frequenting and mm. chances are you, you know, know where the hot yeah. spot is. Yeah? yeah. So, bro, 
check yourself probably you're over what mm, doing it you're over happening mm. and then another thing would be uh your work is suffering mm. like the moment you realize that work is suffering yeah what i mean is uh, the mm. inconsistency maybe in uh how you really show up at work yeah uh if you're self-employed the productivity bit of it you're not really as productive you have clients really you know mm. Uh, not receiving their orders or server in time yeah because you 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 were out on a friday night you're out on a saturday night you're out on a sunday night and then suddenly monday when the client is expecting probably their delivery you're waking what? up at 3 p.m you understand and uh, you're still dealing with uh, a hangover of uh, you know the previous night and then this doesn't happen to be something that's happening for that particular time it's becoming a what a pattern so if you're realizing you have that pattern uh bro mm, yeah check yourself just 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 do check yourself mm. uh, i think for me those are some of the things that you can really put into account yeah, yeah another thing would be uh last thing would be if your um relatives or your partner if you're in a relationship is talking about the thing mm. frequently mm. you understand mm. if you hear like this person is really saying okay now i, I think you're over drinking oh i think mm. you're over you know yeah. partying mm. check yourself because i don't think these people just come out of the blame like hey i, I think mm. uh you've gone out today mm. uh and i think you're over partying no they don't do that yeah? Yeah. yeah i think they just get to express themselves after realizing there's a pattern yeah like you know uh you're the you're the guy who's always uh out on thursday friday saturday saturday Sunday. sunday monday we're going for a band tuesday again somewhere you, you understand like bro rest like just rest so uh for me those are the main things that uh, i would uh, mm. put into account uh at this particular moment i would want to ask my um my co-host here yeah of what advice they would give to a person who has realized that uh, they are over partying but no i'm not yeah so uh no today we're not offering any advice this this guys know what they are doing the moment <laughs> you open they're going to look at you like is the money yours <laughs> <"Kati mbuchi."> yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah? Is, is, is it your money yeah no, is it your money need like it. like can Maybe we fact check do. you can we fact check you okay i i would i would really want to be here and then offer advice and of uh, <laughs> and then on sunday <laughs> we're in the me. same place <laughs> and then on sunday <laughs> we're in the same place you that understand doesn't yeah mean, it doesn't mean you'll be going there all the time okay whatever the case these guys here yeah do you know there's some people who are willing to take in advice mm. there's other people who are going to take in advice yeah i'm sorry i'm being judgmental maybe yeah <laughs> but this advice is not today all yeah. we're saying is we're giving you hints on how you can really tell whether you're what you're, you're over partying mm. or not yeah mm. so period and uh, that uh, has been it for today mm. unless they want to really say something <laughs> which haven't which but, haven't yeah. which haven't asked for yeah and they're doing it as in videos yeah it's not part of the cup talk show so they <laughs> all they're, they're yeah, holding up nah, this yeah. so if you have you're something that you want to yeah you know, you no know. if you want to say something to a person who thinks they are over partying not part of the cup talk show as patricia why am i part Fifi. of the cup talk show yeah, all right <laughs> please go ahead anyway guys <laughs> me i'll just tell you one word maybe i'm a son you tell you why you do what you're supposed to do yeah. if kids are going back to school pay the fees but you take why you at a teleco age limit and you can get you saw a training video of an old man got at him you know he's a girl shake you as well even did that and nobody <laughs> just him no. away from the party so do what you're supposed to do every am asking you take as time goes on more things yeah. come in try to mention the iphone 14 would be here now so as time goes on more things come just do what you're supposed to do secure your life yeah so you even save yourself for better things that are coming ahead that's what yeah. i have to say <laughs> all right thank you for uh for that <laughs> advice yeah <laughs> that was patricia yeah yeah and uh you said we shouldn't advise anyone and i'm saying 
thing. That, that level. level no, thing. I'm just, I'm just asking Shan yeah. if she has something to, to tell you guys. We are not yeah. advising. You're not advising. Yeah, yeah, we're just saying. Out our it's okay. <laughs> if, do you have anything? Do you have sure. anything? <laughs> Let me reserve my, now my, bring my, my, out your pictures. <laughs> I don't want to tell people. All right, anything all right. Looks like, like uh, Shan <laughs> so. is saying. Uh, she can't. You know, no, you know what you're supposed someone to do. Someone will yeah? comment there and be like, "That's <laughs> No, I'm not advising on that. Anyway, anyway, uh, guys, that has it. Uh, mm-hmm. That has been it for 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 today. So if uh, you are there and uh, you feel like you can uh, give in, you know some advice mm. utilize the comment section yeah mm. and uh before anything else maybe moving on please subscribe if you haven't the notification button is just so powerful the magic and uh, once again cup talk show uh right here on connect tv powered by topo Mentor uganda all right thank you so much until next time